Welcome to my channel's Striker 24 x 7 If you like my YouTube videos then Subscribe Click the bell icon Like Comment And share In this video, we are going to see the web server hardening VC Dial uses Apache as its web server Apache is a free and open source web server software With respect to VC Dial There are a few security issues in Apache configuration Number 1. Directory listing by default in VC Dial, once you browse any of the VC Dial path, you may notice, it will display all the files and folders within that folder. The problem with this issue is, it will expose some sensitive data, particularly for recordings. There are a couple of .txt files which has sensitive data. Example, project underscore auth underscore entries .txt file, which exposes the MySQL table name, user ID and password used. Next VC dial underscore auth underscore entries dot txt file, which exposes user IDs, local LAN IPs used to log in. Next VC dial underscore debug dot txt file, which exposes the VC dial server IP and SIP user IDs. Next recordings path, which exposes all the folders, as well lists all the recordings files which includes customer numbers. We need to stop this directory listing, as well stop the logging of VC auth entries in web folders. To disable the folder listing, you need to use the option hyphen index and plus follow sim links in the web server config file. If you are using VC box, then you need to edit two files, 1111-default hyphen hyphen sl.conf and 111-default.conf files, and add or edit the line option space hyphen index space plus follow sim links. Follow to that restart the Apache service. If you are using CentOS or other scratch install, then you need to edit the file httpd.conf file and add or edit the line option space hyphen index space plus follow sim links. Follow to that restart the web server services. Note for the VC dial recording folder path you need to edit a different file. If you are using VC box, you need to edit the file VC record.conf file under etc apache2 conf.d folder. Then replace the line option space index space multi view to option space hyphen indexes space plus follow sim links. Follow to that restart the Apache service. For CentOS or Scratch install, replace the index option under the alias settings in same httpd.conf file and restart the httpd service. Now access the VC dial web folder paths, you may notice the message access forbidden. Similarly for agent folder path. Then the recordings folder path, access forbidden. Note to access the recordings, you need to access the full URL of the recording download link. Number 2, VC Dial Default Web Path Names. The default VC Dial admin path is http colon slash slash server ip slash vc dial slash admin dot php. For agent portal, it's http colon slash slash server ip slash agcvc dial dot php and for recordings http colon slash slash server ip slash recordings. These paths are well known and can be accessed by anyone who knows the server ip. For best practice, these default paths should be changed to specific name so that only the users who knows the path can access the vc dial login portal. Example, http colon slash slash server ip slash abc xyz slash vc dial slash admin dot php here is the steps to change the default folder path if you're using vc box the web folder root directory is slash srv www docs slash navigate to the web root directory now create a folder using mkdir command for example i create a folder names as abcxyx now move all the VC dial related files and folders to our new folder using MV command. Next delete the index.html file, which basically redirect the users to VC dial path, which showcase that we are using VC dial software. If you are using CentOS or other scratch install, the web root path will be var www html. Similar way create a new folder and move all the VC dial folders to this new folder. Finally, you can access your VC dial with new folder path as URL. That is http colon slash slash server ip slash abcxyxvc dial slash admin dot php. Note, the folder name abcxyx is just an example, 
Use a complex name and share the same to the users who want to access your dialer. Number 3. Recording Folder Name The default path for the recording file on VC dial is http colon slash slash server ip slash recordings, which is well-known path to anyone, that is anyone who know this path can download the recording files. For better security, I recommend to change this recording's default name to some unique and complex name. Example XXXYYY1234, so that only those who knows this exact path can access the recordings. To rename this name, you need to edit the file named vcrecord.conf, under etc, apache2, conf.d folder. Now rename the work recordings to some name, for example I use abcxyx. Finally you need to edit the vc dial scripts to use this new recordings path name. There are three scripts to edit. I use sed command to replace the word recordings to our new path name. I have provided these command in this video description. Number 4. Recording folder path without authentication. By default in VC dial, while accessing the recordings path, it won't prompt for authentication. That is anyone can access recordings without any username and password. To authenticate the recordings path, we can use the module called HTPassWD. I have dedicated video for securing the VC dial recordings folder. Link provided in this video description. Number 5. PHP My Admin. PHP My Admin is a free and open source administration tool for MySQL and MariaDB. In VC Box, the PHP My Admin portal can be accessed by browsing http colon slash slash server ip slash php my admin. The default username to log in PHP My Admin portal are the same credentials used to log in to MySQL or MariaDB. That is cron, 1234 or root without any password. Once logged in, an user can execute all sort of MySQL commands like create, delete, alter. If you have installed PHP My Admin in your VC box, then by default the PHP My Admin portal is not restricted to a particular IP address. For better security, you need to restrict the PHP My Admin portal access to a specific IP or specific subnet, or better uninstall PHP My Admin. To enable the IP restriction in VC box, navigate to the folder etc apache2 conf.d then rename the file phpmyadmin.conf.rpm save to phpmyadmin.conf by default all class c sub and ips allowed if you want to add any specific ip then add the same and restart the apache once thanks for watching check out the part 4 video of this video series for vc dial security at software and os level